Catherine Milton, the director of the AT Lab, um, invited a Belgian artist to come here to do a residency. His name is Angelo Vermeulen. Um, and he is an installation bio artist. And I was really interested in all of his past exhibitions because there's a place in my heart for biology and for ecology. I was definitely not considering it at as being my thesis film. It sort of like morphed into that because I kept filming and filming. He came here with an idea to build a social sculpture that was also a living um, game computer. There was a, uh, a multiplayer game that when everyone would come into this space, they were able to play this multiplayer game. And while they played the game, the processors from all five computers generated heat. And then the heat from the processors helped the plants inside of the sculpture to grow. So that was the main sort of concept of it. And it was sort of like this cycle that really interested people. Um, and so my documentary was on that process. But to think about having computers and technology and an ecosystem in the same space together. And that was something that people had never really seen before or thought about. So it really opened a lot of people's eyes as to, as to how um, we should look at installation art now and contemporary art. And it's especially interesting how that affected um, all the young people here on campus. I'm proud of the fact that, I, that um, I'm actually going to have uh, my first feature-length documentary, something that I, can, that I can send to festivals and be proud of, and um, something that I hope that the school film and, and this university can also be proud of. The best advice I could give to someone to help him or her succeed at Ohio University is to have um, a broad undergraduate experience and to study anything that they want to study if they can.